also quick tool haul i went to a uh i had to drive like 40 miles but i went to a local welding supply store um called paxar welding supplies um gentleman i spoke to was very nice um and he had this jacket that i i just i had to pick it up it was the only jacket he had um but it's a tillman size extra large um fire retardant front and it's got the actual leather sleeves for the sides so if you do a lot of grinding um it's good for that and it's you know uh just like your normal welding gloves um if you have a soft leather set of welding gloves um but from everything I've spoke, everybody I've spoken to, Tillman is the best. So I picked this up. It was only forty-five dollars. I could not pass it up because it wasn't, you know, normally extremely expensive like most Tillman stuff. There's a couple other um, welding companies that they make stuff that's really expensive. I think they're called what Black Horse. Yeah, Black Horse has a lot of expensive welding stuff. Like, um, I went to two different welding supply stores today. Um, Paxar and then Brown's Welding. Brown's Welding, they had a, uh, a, uh, not a suede leather. It was a pigskin leather jacket. It was a pigskin leather jacket they had that was like 140 something dollars. Um, but all in time, I can always go back and pick one of those up if, if I want to, but... I do a lot of grinding, so I picked this one up, and it's also rated for welding also. So, thought I'd share with you guys. It's a pretty nice jacket. Um, 45 after tax is not, you know, a bad deal. Uh, please comment, rate, subscribe, uh, or like and subscribe, and um, hit the bell notification icon if you'd like to see future videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.